18 National Youth Service buses deployed to serve commuters in Nairobi have been grounded, just one year after the program was launched. A report tabled before the National Assembly by Auditor General Edward Uka has revealed that fewer than 10 of the buses are still operational. The program dubbed Oka Abiria was launched in March last year to serve commuters on the Kaibara, Githharai, Mwiki, Mugaru Kwanjenga, Dandora, Kariobangi and Kawangwe routes. The fare was only SH-20. The program had 27 buses earmarked for implementation. As at the time of audit, only 9 buses were still operational while 18 had broken down and were grounded, says Mr. Uko in an audit report on the National Youth Service Mechanical and Transport Fund. The program was aimed at alleviating the transport crisis in the city's densely populated areas during peak periods by charging heavily subsidized fares to passengers. Budgetary Provision Co. criticized the program after it emerged that it was started without any budgetary provision to fund the maintenance of the buses and other operational costs. He explained that despite the bus service being subsidized, there were no subsidy funds to sustain the program. During the launch, then this Director General Richard Ndubai had described the project as a long-term plan to resolve the city's transport crisis. He even assured the public that there would be an additional 50 buses to serve other routes within Nairobi. The NIS Mechanical Transport Fund is also on the spot for borrowing over SH 1.1 billion in a questionable manner for the maintenance and repair of its vehicles and equipment. According to the report, the amount was borrowed by the State Department for Public Service and Youth without appropriate authority. Uko says the department is yet to refund SH-635 million, and that the amounts have not been reflected in its financial statement for the 2017-2018 financial